All right, so just so you guys know, there is a Man Cave Tool Store. The link is in the description below. You can get a hat, shirt, hoodie, long sleeve shirts, mugs, stickers, and a whole assortment of stuff. So please like this video and subscribe to the channel. All right, so I actually have help today with Laughing Dragon Foundries. I have James Spears here. We're actually gonna go around uh, Home Depot and see if they have any deals on today. Now, I haven't been to this location of the Home Depot in a long time. We are in Round Lake, Illinois. And yeah, uh, since I haven't been here in a while, I wanna see what type of uh, tools that they have here and see if they actually have different tools that my Home Depot has. So let's see what they got. This mask, by the way, is awesome. So James uh, actually 3D printed this. You can get it at the Etsy store. The link is in the description below. And yeah, the, I actually, it, it feels good to wear it you know, because it's not a boring mask. So, so yeah, it's actually good. It's, it's actually pretty awesome to wear this. We so some good, we got some good response so far. Yeah, a couple of uh, Home Depot employees saw this. You know, they, they actually love it and they, are, they want it. So we uh, showed them where the Etsy store is and they're gonna get it. And when it comes to Nikita, it looks like that they have the same tools that my store has when it comes to this display. Uh, miter saws, anything special? No, no sales. They do have the subcompact rigid and the wrench as well. Nothing new. I'm wondering if they have any of the new Ryobi tools here. No, they do not. Yeah, the same prices for for these. The XPS bits. That. God, it's seriously disappointing that they have nothing new, uh, like special out here. Yeah, that's the same price over at my Home Depot, two twenty nine. All right. So when it comes to like this is the the this is for the sale that used to be here. So like for the one twenty nine for the four hundred hour battery and charger. 200 for the uh, brushless uh, drill and impact driver uh, and two three amp hour batteries and a charger for 200 bucks multi uh, multi tool 100 bucks 12 I think that's 12 volt no 18 volt oh, same thing with the recip saw sander 80 bucks and 100 uh, 80 dollars and 100 dollars in Milwaukee the, the still the same deal $150 for the brushed uh, 12 volt M12 drill and impact. You get a free two amp hour battery. $20 for this uh, bit kit. $200 for the brushless uh, uh, impact and drill. The two two amp hour batteries and a charger. And you get a free two amp hour battery. Find anything interesting? Or get Milwaukee. Size? Uh, I, I do not know. That's probably a quarter, uh, a quarter inch standard size for I can, I can for bits. Hey, so how about a ratcheting wrench? Wouldn't that work? No, 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 because I want to be able to, the socket, the nozzle will stay in the socket when I unscrew it or screw it back in. I gotcha. Because it's hot. I've got wrenches, like, the problem is when I undo it with the wrench, the nozzle's hot, and I'm, like, trying to avoid it. Like I gotcha, and you don't want to pick it up. I gotcha. The table or whatever. So, yeah, with this, I can just unscrew it. It stays right in the wrench. Tap it out. Perfect. It yeah. All right, DeWalt Flexvolt, nothing. Wow, that that went up in price big time. That used to be 230. Ooh, that's that's new. This is new. Comes with battery too. Yeah, this one's new. This, this is this. This isn't the Whisper uh, series. No. No, that's new. I have the Whisper. Is it better? Uh, I do not know. 525 CFM. We'll compare it to the to the other one that is that is over there. It looks like that they still have uh, the deals that's going on. So 129 uh, for the Surge quarter inch X uh, hydraulic driver. 130 for the hammer drill, the fuel version. 200. For the 5 amp hour and 2 amp hour battery kit. And of course, you get a tool for free. 120 for, for the multi tool, but they just made a new version of this. It's fuel. 
Diablo blades. I'm, I'm gonna, I gotta pick some of those up. Uh, 120 for the six amp hour battery. That needs to come down in price. It's selling for like 80 bucks. $100 still for the impact driver and the fuel hammer drill, the M12. This is a good deal. When it comes to real deals, those $100 each, that's a good deal. I, I love those too. Uh, the Milwaukee Packout system. And it's trimmer, 100 bucks for that, wow. That's not bad. 100 bucks. Tool only, I'm assuming. Gobi, uh, they're still having the deal. They actually might be out of batteries, though. I think they're, I think they're out of, are they out of batteries? There's they actually... on the wall back there. Oops, sorry. But yeah, they're still having their deal. There's only a few tools left from the sale. A few tools left. If this thing is, I bet you this thing is garbage compared to what's coming out. Yeah. I already posted a video of Ryobi days, so. So, how much is this sleep? How much is this mower going for? $259. $259. Two fifty nine for the non self propelled, and three fifty nine for the uh, self propelled one. That's those up there. See, dude, it doesn't even feel like I'm wearing this mask. Hold on, though. See, it doesn't even feel like I'm wearing the mask. It's awesome. It actually feels good on the face. It feels really good on the face. Now let's go head over to the other aisle. Let's see what uh. See what they got. I am going to pick these up. Alright, do they got anything new? Yeah, there's no deals. Like, there's, like none of this stuff is on sale. You know, it, it, it's disappointing on how much, how little of a sale Home Depot was having. Especially when there's a, a multiple uh, brands doing new lines. Makita's doing a new line. Milwaukee's doing a new line. I just saw a 60 volt mower by Toro. Yeah, so like they're, they're seriously, the, it's the like, and, and there's no sales. Yeah. Ryobi's coming out with a new line, and so, yeah. All right, back to the Death Star. <laughs> Excellent. Alrighty, so Home Depot, you know, I do not know what's going on. I do know what's going on, but uh, I just don't understand why they're not having any real good deals. But I I did want to test, test this uh, cosplay faceplate out, and this thing is awesome. This thing is awesome. Now, this thing is... Uh, lined with cloth on the inside and I'm going to modify it a little bit to uh to add a little bit more cloth but this thing is awesome now you saw in the video already it's uh it actually people were looking at it you know and people were getting a good reaction but I will be wearing this for now on when I go out to the grocery store or gas station or or any store going out in general I will be wearing this for now on this thing is uh this thing is awesome so and so it's Darth Vader. You know, you can't go wrong with Darth Vader. So once again, this is in the Etsy store in the description below. You also can get man caver stuff, you know, like I have it in the, like in the beginning of the video, shirts and stuff like that. I just wear this. I wear this because it's a little chilly outside. Uh, it's not in the 80s or 90s right now. It's in the low 70s at the moment. So I've been wearing this for the past few episodes. So yeah, yeah this thing's awesome though. This thing's awesome. And it actually, it feels like you're wearing a regular mask because, you know, you feel... Uh, what society is getting used to now. So, yeah, this is not uh, this is not a medical mask. This is a cosplay faceplate of Darth Vader. And so, yeah, I love it. I also did a couple of random things around the house. I power washed the deck. It is awesome. I mean, this is like 20 something, maybe more feet. Same thing with the screen and porch. Still got a little little work to do on it, but but yeah, got my little pool. I, took, I had a bigger one, but I took that out, put this one in its place. But yeah, it's coming much better. I gotta burn those logs too. I use my Hilti saw, recip saws, and I trimmed out some uh, a lot of the branches that were 
too long hanging over the yard. I would always have to like do this to mow the grass. So I decided to finally do it. This is, I gotta burn this stuff still. Much better. This was all ingrown weeds and bushes. Now what's not on our property are the, those bushes. I wanna talk to the homeowner of that. He rents uh, and take those four bushes out. Uh, and so, yeah, so it's, uh, everything's looking much better. I've been, uh, so I've been working on the yard a lot this summer instead of the house, the actual interior of the house. So it's, so I did, uh, so James is with Life and Dragon Foundries and, uh, I did ask him to do me a favor and film three, uh, printing one of these out. You know, I love watching 3d printed stuff, you know, and you just see the, the object is uh, raised as it's being printed. And so, yeah, this thing is awesome. He does is he builds costumes live and his Facebook feed actually gets a lot of views but his YouTube is slacking a little bit when it comes to the views from from YouTube but his Facebook views is getting a lot of views so uh, check out his uh, YouTube channel the link is in, in the description below and yeah this thing is uh this thing is awesome so please like this video please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel this is Dave Nicholas thank you for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time